So here we are, we've just arrived at the Lux Grand Bay in Mauritius. I'm so excited to be here. We're here for five days on the premium all-inclusive package. Yesterday we did a full day in Dubai. We got the night flight at 2 a.m. from Dubai to Mauritius. Uh, so we flew all night. I didn't sleep a wink. I don't know how, but um, the flight over from Dubai is six hours. Damien slept a good five hours of that. Um, and then the car ride was just over an hour from the airport up to Lux Grand Bay. Um, so we're just now waiting to check in. The hotel from what we've seen so far is absolutely beautiful. This is the entrance as you walk into Mauritius Grand Bay Resort. It's absolutely beautiful. It's absolutely huge, very, very modern, but also different to the uh, previous looks we stayed in in the Maldives. Um, this is where we sat to do our check-in. And then over here, you have got a little bar which does all of the coffees as well. So we're just gonna get a, few, a quick coffee from there, try and wake up a little bit. So our flight arrived quite early into Mauritius and we got through the airport really, really quickly as well. Um, so that means the room is not ready when we come to check in. However, we've just got changed. Give us a little room to get changed in with a shower and everything. We even had coffee and now we've just found our way to the pool. So at the moment, we're still waiting for our room. We've had a little walk along the beach as well. Also beautiful. And now we're just relaxing by the pool. In a minute, I think we're going to go for a spot of lunch and then hopefully our room will be ready by then. But in the interim, we're just having some drinks by the pool. I've lost Damien completely. Damien's in the wine menu. So he'll be there all day looking at that. Because I think he likes to try a little bit of everything in regards to alcohol, whereas I'm not too bothered about alcohol. Um, but I have just had some cocktails at the pool and they were very, very good. How is the wine menu? It's good. I think she knew that it's true of how this all works. But, uh... well, at the minute, the only thing we're a little bit confused about is we are not sure what's included. And the one at the minute has explained that to us. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so we're still a little bit lost. Maybe later when we do the hotel tour, they'll tell us how it works. Um, but at the menu at the minute, we're not too sure. I mean, it does say on the menu for the food, but on the drinks, we, we're clueless. So we've just finished the appetizers and the main courses have just arrived. Um, we're still in Beach Rouge and we've gone for catch of the day. Um, I think we're gonna try and be a little bit healthy on this holiday or that's how we're trying to start out anyway. But uh, yeah, we're gonna enjoy. So this is our room, it's absolutely huge. This is the bathroom. So we've got double sinks. Oh, we've got a shower and a bathtub. That looks beautiful. And then we've got a toilet in here. And then we're gonna go into the main room. There's a little desk area here. And then we go straight into the main room just here. And then this is a view. One of my favorite things to do is check out the mini bar and look at this. This is all included in our plan. Now it's um, around six o'clock. Um, we're going to Aikisu for dinner this evening. And Damien's booked it for 6.30, which is super, super early. Um, it's Asian uh, inspired food, which I'm not really too keen on, but I'm not too hungry either because we've only really just eaten a few hours ago. Um, so we're gonna head over there now. Now the sun's just setting. It's looking absolutely beautiful. And on a night, they light this fire pit as well. I think it's going to be absolutely stunning tonight. Arrived on a pig, you can see that. 
but I mean, you definitely wouldn't get that in Dubai. Um, we've got the vegetable tempura here, we've got the duck here. Beef satay. Beef satay here. And the uh, dumplings. And then the main thing is, is we've got the dumplings in here as well. So we're gonna go now and have our banquet. It looks absolutely phenomenal. I'll let you know how it is once we're finished. I've just got back from dinner. Um, Damien really, really enjoyed it. As I say, it's not my kind of food. It was nice. It looked phenomenal, but for me, it's not for me. Um, we're still a bit com confused by the package that we're on. Um, the menus are not really too clear, in all honesty. Um, on the, they say it's the all-inclusive that we're on, but when I booked it, I booked the premium all-inclusive, which included the champagne, like the Maldives, and that's what they sent me all the list on, and it says champagne's included. However, we've got here and they say champagne is not included. Um, but at the end, we still signed a bill of over 6,000 rupees. I know it's not a lot, but we don't really know what we're signing for. It's tomorrow morning after breakfast, we're gonna go and try and speak to somebody to clarify um, the packages because I've got the emails confirming. Um, so we're just a bit unsure to be honest. So we're now on day two of the holiday. We have just woken up. We had the most amazing sleep. The bed here is absolutely huge and you just kind of sink into it. It's absolutely incredible. Um, Damien has just said he's not slept so long in, in a long time. We literally got 12 hours sleep last night. Um, so now it's nine o'clock. Damien's just gone to the gym. Um, I'm getting myself ready. Look at this view. So when I booked Mauritius uh, for Damien's birthday, I was a little bit worried because it said, although March is good for sunwise, it's also the rainiest month. Um, but luckily, the weather seems to be on our side. It's absolutely gorgeous weather. Um, so I'm just gonna go inside now and uh, get myself ready. Then I'll meet Damien in breakfast. Um, so far, I have just got this little set on. So I just need to now just sort my hair out. Just come down now for breakfast in Beach Rouge. Again, absolutely phenomenal. One of the, probably one of the best hotel breakfasts I've ever seen in my life. So all of the hot meals at Alica, which you order off here, as much as you like. And then they have a great breakfast uh, selection indoors as well. Um, there's things such as places to make smoothies with um, protein, you can add protein. It's oh, yeah, yes. okay. um, so I'm showing you now. So we're just getting our smoothie made. They even have protein powders. Never ever in any hotel have I ever stayed at has got these. My breakfast has just arrived. I've got this acai bowl. I absolutely love acai. And then I got my iced coffee and I got a smoothie. As well, I ordered the avocado on toast with egg and Damien. It's got some kind of, I think it's some kind of omelette, green omelette with vegetables. We've now just had a little stroll along the beach. These houses are absolutely phenomenal. The sea is a really nice temperature as well. And then just over in the distance, that's our hotel, the Lux Grand Bay. The beach is really, really nice as well. The sand's really nice to walk on. So after our little stroll along the beach, we actually just called at the activity center and there's a snorkeling trip that goes twice a day at 11 and two. So we've literally just got our, our things now and we're going snorkeling. I've never been snorkeling in Mauritius. So I don't really know what to expect, but uh, we may as well go and see what it's like. So we're now just on the boat um, out to go snorkeling. It's a glass bottom boat, which I've never actually seen before. So it's really, really cool. At the minute, there's just us two as well. So it's really, really nice. We're just on the boat now. And we're just on our way back now to the hotel. So lunch has just arrived, it looks absolutely divine. We're trying to still be healthy on holiday to be honest, 
Damien got the chop chop salad, which is absolutely huge. And I've got the Caesar salad. Then we did order a steak sandwich as well. It's now day three and we're just making it to the gym. day three of our holiday. Um, it's nine o'clock now. We've been so productive this morning already. We've been to the gym. It's to be honest, the first time I've actually made it to the gym all holiday. Um, so the gym here is really, really nice. We only went to the indoor gym, but um, there's also an upstairs one as well. This is Beach Rouge. So this is where we come for breakfast. There's a choice. You can sit outside, you can sit inside and the little pods as well. And for breakfast today, Damien got the egg white omelette with vegetables. It's got some salmon and cheese. And then I've got the avocado on toast. Got no egg on it today. And as well, I just wanted to have a look and try these pecan pancakes, which I think we're gonna share. And I've got a banana. And as well, um, they don't do Nutella, but they do this um, homemade hazelnut spread, which I'm guessing is their take on Nutella. So now we're just spending the rest of the day at the pool. Um, it's so so hot. We're going through our sun cream like water. Um, I mean to be honest I'm not one normally to wear sun cream. I know I shouldn't really say that but we have got lots of factor 50 and lots of factor 30 with us. The sun here is so so strong so just make sure if you come to Mauritius um, you do bring plenty of high factors. Um, at the other Lux hotel where we stayed at there were pots of sun bum all over um, that you could just use throughout the resort. Here there is no suntan cream available so you do have to make sure that you do pack your own. Um, so the rest of the day we're just going to spend enjoying at the pool. Damien's now just gone to find us some drinks. Um, it's a little bit hit and miss to be honest while we're at the pool to, to get drinks. Um, there is a pool bar but for some reason they tell us that we have to order inside but then we don't really want to go inside it's dripping in water in our swimwear so it's a bit like hit and miss. Um, but we're going to enjoy the day now at the pool. My drink's just arrived. I've got a frozen strawberry daiquiri. We've just ordered some more drinks. Um, I've got a pina colada this time. I have been getting all my drinks frozen, but this time I've just chosen the normal pina colada. Um, Damien's gone for his apparel spritz. We just finished our lunch now. Um, we're so full, we can hardly move. We're just waiting on Damien to get a double espresso, and then I think we're going to try and make a move up to the infinity pool upstairs. So here are some of the sunbeds in Biso, which is the infinity pool. It's absolutely beautiful up here. So relaxing. So, so quiet as well. There's not many uh, guests here today. The main thing is it's super, super clean. And this is the infinity pool. Damien's in the pool just now. And this is where the Instagrammable swing is. But look at this view. This view is phenomenal. The drinks up here as well, we have found to be the best on the resort so far. And as well, you've also got these little swings as well, which are very, very cute. Damien's just got a gin and tonic. It's absolutely massive. It's Monkey 47 gin and slimline tonic. And then I've got a pina colada. I mean, look how refreshing they look. We're just leaving Biso now and we're going to the back to get showered and then go out tonight. Um, we have dinner booked in Biso tonight. Um, I think it's more of an Indian theme. Um, but I could be wrong on that. Um, but I'm very excited to try it tonight. We're now just up out for dinner. It's about half past six, so we'll get some sunset drinks first. Sunset here at the minute is around 6.40. So I've just got on this black dress from Zara. Now, one thing I do like about this hotel is everyone seems to make an effort on a night time. for our dinner reservation. Um, when we checked in, they told us to book any reservations through the app. So we have booked a reservation for tonight at Bisa. So we've gone upstairs and like, oh, your name's not on the list. 
like, oh, but we have it on the app here. Let, let's show you. No, your name's not on the list. We said, okay, if our name's not on the list, can we please just get a table for two? No, your name's not on the list. So at the minute, we currently sat in reception. Um, but as I said, we've been on the wrong package to start with. Um, we should have had the champagne included from uh, initial check-in. However, it was like the end of day two where we actually got the champagne included in our package. There seems to be a lot of communication regarding our package. It's, uh, it's not ideal, to be honest. So for the appetizers, we're going to share them, but Damien's got Arabic meze and I've got the um, butter chicken, black chicken tikka. So for Slim Bee Soup, the main course has just arrived. It looks absolutely phenomenal. So I'm going to show you what we have. So Damien has the tuna. I have got french fries because I have to have them with everything. And then we have a butter chicken. Um, they didn't have naan bread. Naan bread is on the menu, but they don't have it tonight. So we have this other style bread, which is absolutely perfect. And we have a white rice as well. So I'm so excited to eat this. We've now just got back in the room. We had dinner at Bisu. And once we got a reservation, it was absolutely fantastic food. Um, so full, we didn't even manage desserts. To be honest, we've not had desserts all holiday or looked at a menu because we're always so full. The food is so, so good. Um, so now we're going to watch Drive to Survive and then wake up early in the morning and go to the gym. Today is day four of our holiday. We've already been to the gym this morning. Um, I'm so happy we've been managing to go to the gym. I've managed it twice so far. Um, the gym this morning was really busy, but we got a beautiful smoothie afterwards. Um, the weather today is not that sunny. I mean, it's hot. It's very, very humid but it's not actually that sunny. So now I've just got ready, just got showered again, just got ready, and we're gonna go for breakfast. I think we're gonna share breakfast, to be honest, because we had a smoothie, both each coming out of the gym, and um, I'm not that hungry, to be honest. So I'm just all ready to go. I've just got on this little set from River Island and this little hat. Um, so we're gonna go now for breakfast. So we're just down at breakfast now. Um, we've just got an avocado on toast to share. Um, as well, I've got a smoothie. The smoothies here are absolutely fantastic. Now we're back up at the pool at Biso. Um, this is our last final day here. So we're gonna spend it up at this pool. We've just ordered some drinks now by the pool. There is a lovely, lovely breeze. Apparently a second cyclone is coming in. There was a cyclone a, a week or two ago. Um, so now Damien's absolutely terrified. We're gonna get stuck here and the flights are gonna be canceled, but we should be absolutely fine. Um, I have just ordered a... Uh, what did I order? Pina ah, pina colada. This, this is my first one of the day, don't worry, I've not had too many. And uh, Damien has got his apparel spread. So I have actually just double checked with one of the waiters and um, he did say that Biso, you can actually buy day passes. It's 14,000 rupees per person. But with that, you do get some drinks included, you do get some food included, and you can also go to the beach and you can also go to Beach Rouge and you can also go to the pool downstairs. Whereas if you buy a pool pass for the pool downstairs, it's about seven or 8,000 rupees per person. And you only get access to that pool, drinks, some food in Beach Rouge and um, the, the beach. You cannot actually buy a day pass for Beach Rouge and then come up to be so. Um, so I just wondered. And as well, he said, Upstairs in Biso, which is the one that I'm in now, the rooftop pool, it said it's only for children aged 12 and above. So I've just ordered another cocktail. Now I've got a frozen strawberry daiquiri. It's absolutely delicious. Damien still lines apparel spritz. Um, so we're just going to finish our drinks off and then we're going to go downstairs and go to Beach Rouge for lunch. Um, they do serve lunch up here. Um, the venue, menu is slightly smaller than downstairs, but um, we're just fancying a salad to be honest. So we're going to go down to Beach Rouge for, for lunch. Just now in Beach Rouge for lunch, as per, it's absolutely beautiful. I'll show you what we've ordered. So all of the food we're going to share, I got the Wagyu beef burger with french fries, we've got the Caesar salad with prawns, I've literally had this every day since we've been here and every day it's been super delicious so why not get it today? And Damien's got the tuna poke bowl. The weather outside has turned, um, it's a little bit windy and there's no sun at all so we've come in now to Mason Lux which is the coffee shop in the lobby of the hotel. Um, so I'm just going to order a tea 
Uh, Damien's gone to the bar downstairs just to get a, um, another gin and tonic. So he wants the Monkey 47, which you don't have upstairs, so he just ran down for it there. We're just now sat in the lobby and look how cute this little teapot is. I just think that's absolutely beautiful. It's just the perfect size as well. As well as the gym downstairs, which we have been using, there's also a gym on the rooftop called Muscle Up. I'm gonna show you it now. This is the gym on the rooftop called Muscle Up. It's such a phenomenal thing to see, but it's such a good use of space. You've got your weights over here, your kettlebells, you've got the ropes here more weights and then as well you have also got the bikes it's just such a nice way of using up the space and then over here you have got some boxes if you want to do some jumps or some squats on the boxes and then the view over is of the pools so we're now just heading back to the room uh, we're going to shower and then just relax a bit before we get ready to go out tonight um, it's the final night so we're having dinner in Beach Rouge it's the last night and we're going to Beach Rouge now for dinner. I've just bought this long blue dress and we're going for sunset drinks. So straight ahead it looks like it's raining and the weather app's also showing it's raining so Damien's absolutely paranoid because we're leaving tomorrow. It's paranoid because the waiter earlier said that there might be a cyclone on its way. Damien's now paranoid that our flight's going to be cancelled. He's worrying like crazy. I mean, of course, the flight won't be cancelled, it will be fine, but uh, Damien is worrying, bless him. So tonight we've come for dinner at Beach Rouge, expecting the normal a la carte menu, but it's actually a seafood buffet. So the selection looks, again, incredible, so I'm going to show you around. Look at all the oysters. So Damien's just getting us a few oysters just now. These have already been taken out of the tank. There's also sea urchins. This is where they actually mix in the speeches all together. I mean, you've got to admit, it looks pretty good. It's now our last day in Mauritius. We got back from dinner last night and I started to pack. Um, Damien's just packing now. Um, and then we're gonna go get some breakfast. So it's about nine o'clock just now and um, we're getting picked up for the airport around 1 p.m.-ish. Um, it's about an hour's drive back to the airport. Um, and then we're on the 16.25 flight back to Dubai. Um, the weather today is not very good. It's uh, very, very dull, windy, and it's spotting of rain. So we have been so lucky with the weather. Um, it's been absolutely glorious while we have been here. So this is the view from our little balcony on the last day. As you can see, it's looking very grey, dull. There's a few little spots in the swimming pool. So for breakfast on the last day, I've ordered the avocado and eggs on toast with bacon. And as well, I've got the sneaky pancakes. This comes with berries as well. And then I've got my soy latte. I've just literally eaten all of the breakfast that I wanted. And Damien just sat watching me eat the last piece like, oh, you must have been really hungry. <laughs> like, yeah, the breakfast is absolutely amazing. All the food in the hotel is amazing. So I literally ate everything. I've just got my drinks now to go, but um, yeah, I'm very happy. I had a lovely breakfast today. So we're just now back at the airport. We're in the lounge and we have about an hour and a half to wait now until we actually board the aircraft. Um, I just asked Damien to bring me a Coke and of course, he's brought me a champagne. What would you prefer? Um, so um, that's the end of my Mauritius vlogs. I hope you enjoyed watching. I'll have another one for you very soon.